Chance for Ada Amola to get forward down the left hand side. Into Kadurgan. Clumsy challenge. And the referee points to the spot. And an early chance for Crystal Palace to get off to just the right kind of start. It will be Victor Akinwale to try and give Palace an early lead. Yes! And he puts it away confidently. Akinwale scores his first goal in five games. And Palace go 1 0 up after just nine minutes here. Oh, what a job Paddy McCarthy's done in Palace's first year as a Category 1 Academy. They currently sit three points clear. Into Alonso. Alonso getting into the Palace area. It falls to Matarin. Good save from Whitworth. Rebound comes in and Whitworth parries away once again. Spurs' best chance of the game so far. Dan Quick is penalised there. He protests, but the free kick is taken quickly. Into Matarin, and the shot hits the crossbar. It was Donnelly in the end. On the end of Matarin's blocked effort. It's in now to Adaramolu, who can get the shot away, and the goalkeeper pushes it behind. Ball is in towards Quick, headed clear. Balls for Rodney on that far side. Steele is battling away. Bit of head tennis as both sides try and get it under control. Here's Wells Morrison. Rodney now into Steele. Steele's ball across to Raksaki. And he can't believe he's put that one over the top. Well, Palace just looking to see this one out now with just seconds remaining before added time, but Raksaki's got away here and he uses those feet to get into the penalty area well. Laid back to Wells Morrison! And that surely seals it. Crystal Palace heading back to the top of the under 18s Premier League and look at what it means to that side. Joe Whitworth has run the length of the field to celebrate. Palace two. Spurs nil. Well, seconds remain here. Thistleton's throw forwards. Raksaki can use those dancing feet now into the penalty area. Will he get his shot away? It's pushed out, but only as far as Cadogan. Malik Cadogan makes it three, and Crystal Palace march on. That really is the icing on the cake. Well, they were made to work hard for it, but in the end, a comfortable win for Crystal Palace. They go three points clear at the top of the under-18s Premier League as this title race goes right down to the wire.